The Earlham Institute acquired funds from the UK Synthetic Biology for Growth programme in 2015 to start establishing automated workflows and offering that to the UK bioscience community. We have two types of uh, uh, users uh, that came from academia mainly and then small uh, companies that uh, require access to this kind of equipment. What we've done is develop a new way of dyeing fabric using synthetic biology, completely removing the use of any petrochemical or hazardous chemical in a dyeing process. We really didn't have the throughput or capacity to bring these things moving forward at a fast enough pace to keep up with what our customers want. Working with the Earlham Institute allows us to really quickly scale up our R&D and parallel process these colors. The main advantage of using the DNA Foundry is the ability to do experiments at scale. It reduces the amount of time Primarily, the individual scientists spend pipetting by hand. It frees up a lot of their time to spend time doing data analysis and experiment design. The automation equipment allows us to minimize human error, which is the most common error that you can uh, have when working with a thousand of samples. We have two Hamiltons that allow us to work in the range of milliliters of liquid, the ECHO 550, but allow us to scale down the liquids in the nanoliters. The Bioelector Pro, which is a micro-fermentator, and then we have automation for storage. They help us plan the experiments with their know-how so that we don't waste money and time doing things that we don't need, and we have the right people not just to help us do it, but to teach us how to do it better. There are different ways to interact with the foundry. Researchers, can uh, collaborate with us, we can apply for grants, then small companies can request services, but also we can provide training in the automation field. The level of innovation in which we are actually swimming <laughs> all day long is incredible. Feeling that you are working in this kind of field and you can help others to solve their problems is actually amazing.